The white Lamborghini leapt to an early seven second lead across the first competitive stage of the day and then stayed on the pace, finishing the day with a 20 second lead at the end of day one's 88 kilometres of Targa stages. Despite some challenges on the last stage, Mount Rowland. Just had a couple of uh, tiny little issues with um, air supply to the uh, to the clutch setup that's in it and it's um, caused us to miss a couple of gears but only probably talking a couple of seconds here and there. Steve Glennie in a 2009 Nissan GTR is back in second place but is in hot pursuit and well within reach of the Lamborghini. GTRs have their own little minds themselves so it's playing mind games with me, with me at the moment so just sort of trying to sort it out and see, see where, it, where it's at. The current leader of the Australian Tiger Championship Tony Quinn continued to have problems. Jason White also now leading the championship. The classic competition is hotly contested with Tasmanian Peter O'Keefe leading by a narrow four seconds in a Holden Tirana A9X from six-time classic champ Rex Broadbent in a Porsche. TV personality Grant Denyer is amongst a fleet of Renaults in the showroom section and currently sits in second place. Day two sees the 200 car field head out to Tasmania's east coast through a tough set of mountain stages.